dry, but it was rubbery dry. Does that right, make sense? Right, it right? does. It does. It That's just so felt like there was no moisture in it at all. Right. I mean, if there's anything that happens in the kitchen more than any other one thing, I would say it's dry yeah. protein. Yeah. That you're overcooking your food. Yeah. The steam oven allows you to avoid that. Something smells good. Super easy controls. Yeah, let's dig in here. All right. Oh, look at this. What we have... And I don't know if you saw that, but the steam that came out mm. here... I don't know if you can see that on camera. Cooking with steam is so much fun. Oh, look at what we've got here, you guys. I'll get your door. That, oh, thank you so much. I want yeah. to pull that all the way out. Wonderful. There you go. And I actually want what do we to plate a little bit. Is that an of egg bake? This, right, this is an egg bake. Wow. And I'll tell you, I was so excited to do this. My grandmother grew up uh, on the shores of uh, the Mississippi River. Yeah. And every holiday, she would do this amazing egg bake. Wow. I really want to dig some of this out. Have you ate enough yet today, Skip? Are you are you full at this point? No or way. Can we give you a... <laughs> I thought we had met. <laughs> Look at how moist and delicious that looks. Yeah. There's probably, who else? Anyone else in the studio? Who oh, wants, I'm sure. Who wants somebody grandma's else. egg bake here? Well, oh, if, if Henry okay. were here. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my so gosh. great. So cheesy. What cheese did you use? So moist. That, oh, we used a couple different cheeses, a white cheese, an American cheese. Oh. I like to switch it up. Sometimes mm -hmm. use a little bit of spicy cheese even. And, and I'll tell you, this steam oven makes it so ridiculous. Just the easy. right amount of onion. Oh, thank you, sir. Just the right amount. Thank you, thank you, thank so you, So good. Sir. And we all... Yeah. All right. Okay. I'm going to go over I... here one second. I'll be right please back, Please do, Turner. please do. I want to show you everything that you're getting. Folks, this price is not going to be repeated. We started this at two forty nine when he first brought this out. This is our final quantity, meaning that when we sell these out... And we only had about 500 to go around. When we sell these out, these are not coming back. So if you want to retain flavor, nutrients, minerals, vitamins in your food, convection is great. Convection is wonderful, and this is a convection oven. Great for baking because it is a little bit faster and it moves that hot air around. But one of the disadvantages of moving the hot air around, it takes the moisture out of some of your food, especially your vegetables. So, if you want to maintain that, you just simply fill the reservoir. You have the different settings, and they all come with the, uh, the uh, manual that Todd has put together for you. This way, you're going to have orange carrots. You're going to have yellow corn, and I mean that because the moisture is also going to restore the color of your foods, too. So, if you want a moist salmon, if you want some amazing flaky halibut, if you want a moist and tender chicken, Use steam technology. They do make them, but they are thousands of dollars when you are going to buy them in an appliance store. We have this one for under $150, 147 and change. Now, we're already down to 326. All right, so these are going, folks. It's the lowest price ever. The price is not going to be repeated, and it's, uh, it's going to be our final quantity. We're not reordering this after we sell it out today. Such a useful item in the kitchen. Did you bake something? We are baking as well. It's not just proteins, it's not just steamed vegetables, but we've got some flan in here. Let's pull oh, that out. I, I know flan. you've got a sweet tooth, Skip. Yeah, I do. Please tell me you do. Oh, I do. Yeah. Look at how gorgeous these are. I have, I have all are. kinds of teeth, but right? sweet Look is at one how of them. nice those come out. Uh, one of the things with these steam ovens as well, if you're worried about overcooking things, it's really difficult to overcook in a steam oven. It just is a, a, it's just hard to do. Mm -hmm. So what I'm going to do is set that there. And what I want to get to is our biggie here. We made a candy caramel apple bread pudding. <laughs> Look at that, you guys. Look at what this steam oven can do. It's, it, it is just phenomenal. You think? I'm set this down in front of, uh, uh, right on top of our flan uh -huh. here. And I'm going to try and see if we can't. Are you going to try to flip that? I'm going to try and flip that. This Good is, luck with that. This is a first for me. Good here. luck. Good luck. All right. Apple. And there we That's go. That's good. I think you got it. Oh, you did it. Oh, look at that. Look at There's that. There's only moisture. one thing left to do. <laughs> Let's throw a little sugar on top of that. Did too. A little. Oh, a little powdered sugar. 
Look at how gorgeous that is. I need to get Folks. you some of that. Remember, that steam function is going to help you cook super clean, mm. lots of moisture. You can do either. I mean, you can do everything with this. We've got it's three insane. minutes left. So okay, okay, yeah. Let's check this one out as well. We also have the warming function, the bake function. We can do all kinds of. Oh, let's get stick it hit on the this bread snow, pudding. Hey, you, don't, you don't understand. Look at this. Here mm. we did two whole chickens. Chickens is, is one of those things that can get really dry, Skip. Yeah. This steam oven is so great. You can do super steam. You can do broil steam. That's the other nice thing I like to do is actually bring the chickens up and give them that nice crispy crust. You get that crispy chicken skin. My kids sometimes no, I love that. eat no, the chicken. Yeah. They'll eat the, <laughs> the skin. The, right, right. Yeah, no. And then no, look I at agree. these. Look at the bread. There's a whole bread function on here. The bread <laughs> coming out of this unit is mm -hmm. amazing. Got it. I've got it. I'm going to set that right there. And then we got to get the chickens. Bread and chicken. Let's do that. Let's grab those chickens out of there. Ah, there we go. Look at that nice heavy duty door to retain all that moisture. You've got the moisture reservoir up oh, top. Oh, come on. Look, Look at, at those. those chickens, you guys. Oh, my Perfectly gosh. Perfectly done. What I'm going to do is, yeah, I'm going to cut, gonna into dig, cut into that. Show you how amazingly moist that is. Let's get right in here mm. on the breast. I'm going to have some more oh, pudding. Oh, look at that. Look at the moisture just fall out of that meat. Mm. So wonderful. Chicken is a great value. I, you know, for chefs, you know, I spent a couple decades in culinary schools. Chefs will use chicken more than really any other yeah, product yeah. in their careers. So what are you doing now to steam your foods? You love steamed foods. You like to steam your broccoli, your asparagus. You like to steam your fish. What about having an oven that will do it for you? All you have to do, there's a little reservoir right here. I'm lifting it up, mm -hmm. but I'm going to have to drop it in a minute because it's kind of heavy. Uh, there's a <laughs> reservoir right here. One more time. There it is. Right. Got it. You place your water in there, and it will create the steam as well as baking, as well as convection, as well as broiling. All right. We've got less than a minute. What's in here? Oh, let's check this out. Okay, great. Let's jump right here rice you guys you oh. can do amazing rice in here it's about a one-to-one -one water to rice mm -hmm. let's grab that rice out of there oh and it's perfectly done actually yeah maybe it's a little bit too hot for me to just grab no, it. i wouldn't yeah don't yeah, burn yourself i don't want to risk that but doing rice leftovers is another thing we can't forget about leftovers right because Got leftovers it. are king and I'm going to drop that rice there. It makes perfect rice. We were actually sending rice home with some of the folks here at Evive last night. Ah, so, that's so a good versatile, idea. so beautiful. All right, now you're going to stick around because we've got an ice cream maker coming up. Yes, yes. For the summer, <laughs> it's going to be perfect. But if you want Todd English's multi-oven, combo oven, we call it, it's a steamer, a broiler, and a baker all in one for $147.49. And we have fewer than 300 now of those to go around.